oftentimes people ask me what do I do and I say I'm an artist and they started doing this painting oh you paint and I usually say I'm an artist who doesn't know how to paint Sometimes it's very stressful. They have to think of something related to the site. I have to tell you, I really like this kind of challenge. It's there, there's something there. I just have to spend time with the site and then we'll start having the conversations and the site will start speaking to me. That's why people always ask me, where did you get the ideas? I don't know. I don't know where they are from. <laughs> somewhere here in the berry sea they just pop out it's time okay come being an immigrant from taiwan the way i was brought up and then the education i went through obviously will come in like the other you asked me why i use bamboo sticks so often and then actually in chinese tradition they like to have bamboos planted around their living environment does that mean it, there's a cultural significance in there? Or why I use red a lot? Because red in Chinese culture is a lucky color. We use red in Chinese Lunar New Year, where you give red envelopes to other people for weddings. The bride has to dress up red. So red is a color that I grew up with that I feel very comfortable with. And I realized the longer I leave Taiwan, the more red I use. I always say I open a window or open a door for people to see. If they are only interested in just peep into the window, that's fine, they walk by. And well, sometimes they're curious, they want to step in, open the door, step in a little bit, or want to walk in and they explore. It's all up to them. But I have my job, I have to make it interesting enough intriguing enough, accessible enough, so they feel like to go in. And then how much they can take home or take into their brain, it's all up to them. They might not even know it's called art, and that's why I like about it. It's something fun for them to plunge in, and that is good enough. They are trying, something attract them, and then trying to figure out something what's going on. I think that's the first step. And in special public art, I just throw out a hundred seeds. And I don't know how many seedlings will come out. It's not something I can expect, but as an artist, I just try my best. <laughs>